The world's longest aircraft took flight this past week in England. The helium-filled Airlander 10 is more than 300 feet long, nearly 50 feet longer than the biggest passenger planes. It can spend several days in the air without refueling. Jonathan Vigliotti has more on this unusual airship. On an airfield just north of London, the world's longest aircraft spreads its tiny wings and takes to the sky. Measuring in around the width and length of a football field, the Airlander 10 is not what you'd call conventional. Up close, it looks even stranger. This is the flight deck. I'll come bring you up here. But chief test pilot David Burns, who was at the controls for the Airlander's maiden flight, says you need to look beyond the shape of the hull, which has been, you could say, the butt of some jokes, to appreciate this very modern flying machine. A normal flight deck, any, any pilot would feel right at home coming in here. The helium-filled Airlander is in fact a Frankenstein of technologies, taking the shape and lift benefits of a blimp and combining them with the maneuverability of a helicopter and the load capacity of a small cargo plane. Its creators, hybrid air vehicles, claim the aircraft is super efficient. And essentially the engines of four SUVs propel this thing? That's right, yep. Spokesman Chris Daniels claims it could be used to drop humanitarian aid into disaster areas. It can land and take off from anywhere. It's amphibious, it can land on water, land on lakes, um, desert, ice, you name it. But the Airlander can't compete with planes when it comes to speed. It tops off at around 70 miles an hour. Jonathan Vigliotti, CBS News, London.